and there's heavy, thick black smoke that's filling the sky. It's burning pretty well, as you can see. Firefighters are breaking the glass, sizing up the situation, trying to contain the fire. Now, neighbors are out on the sidewalk. Uh, there's a lot of concern, fear, curiosity seekers, of course. And uh, again, the building is vacant. Firefighters are on the scene. They are trying to size up the situation and contain the blaze. We're reporting live from Hartford's Frog Hollow section. I'm Kathy Moss, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. We will uh, bring you more developments as they warrant. All right, Kathy, at this point, I know you just uh, virtually arrived there a few minutes ago, but do you know yet, are they giving you any indication where this fire might have started and whether it might be linked to those other fires not too far away, the suspicious ones? question now, both of them. Uh, the firefighters are all tied up, as you can imagine. They're trying to contain the blaze, trying to keep people at bay to a safe distance from where the fire is happening. As soon as we snag them and talk to them, we'll bring that information to you. All right, we'll look forward to that. Kathy Moss in Hartford tonight. Denise. Operating procedure to see whether there's any kind of involvement in the gas lines. Also, firefighters are still working, and they're trying to check out uh, exactly what uh, caused this fire, what triggered the blaze, and also to make sure the people who are standing on the sidewalk are uh, pretty safe, keeping a safe distance. We spoke to Fire Marshal John Vendetta just a few moments ago. This is what he had to say. Similarities, yes. There's definitely similarities to the other fires. Did you pick off any kind of clues? Uh, right now, my investigative team hasn't started. Still under the suppression phase. Once we get in there, we'll give you uh, some more. But it does appear to have originated under airport. Again, it is a vacant building that is on fire. Firefighters are still working very hard at this late hour. We are on Broad Street between Grant and Russ. As you can imagine, the street is closed. Uh, firefighters are still working, and neighbors are trying to make sense of this, uh, our, this fire, rather, right here on the street this evening. Reporting live from the Hog, Frog Hollow section in Hartford, I'm Kathy Moss, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Kathy, thanks for the update. Of course, the concern is that they're, they may be uh, linked in with some of these other fires that have been deliberately set and uh, not too far from there. Must be another anxious night for that yeah. neighborhood, boy.